Hey Stellars, it's Briar and welcome back or welcome to my channel. Before we get started with today's video, please don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and ring that bell so you never miss out on a brand new video. So for today's video guys, I will be giving you guys all of the locations and where you can find all the objects of the keys, the objects Lana needs, and where you can find the pieces of the map in the second quest and how to get through the maze in the third quest and overall how to defeat the main boss so yeah guys without further ado let's get started with today's tutorial so to find lana's childhood home what you guys want to do is follow the flowers and as you guys can see in the video i am going to be guiding you guys through following the flowers and then you will find lana's childhood home I am going to speed it up a little bit, but this is what it's supposed to look like. The first key that you guys are going to want to go ahead and get is the one that is on the barn. So you're going to go ahead and take a right, climb the ladder, and get the blue key. So the blue key is going to be used to open a door in the parents' room, which is upstairs next to Lana's room. Once you open the door, you are going to go ahead and look for a camera, which is behind some boxes. And then you're going to go ahead and take the camera to Lana's room and place it in her luggage. The next key that you guys want to look for is the green key and it is behind this plant in the living room. So once you get that key, you're going to go ahead and go back to the parents room and that key is going to go ahead and open up the attic. And right behind some boxes, you will be able to find the textbook and take it back to Lana's room. Then you're going to make your way to the kitchen and you're going to turn on the right and go ahead and get the orange key. You go to the room right next to the kitchen and you go to the bathroom. So right behind the trash can, you're going to see the nail file. And what you're going to go ahead and do after that is go upstairs to Lana's room. What you're going to go ahead and do next is go to the kitchen and look for a pot that has a red key. It is on the left and once you do that, you're going to want to go outside and go down to the little like attic, bottom attic, I guess you could say. And then there you will find a journal so you're gonna go ahead and collect the journal and go back upstairs and take it to lana's room the pink key is behind a couple of boxes in lana's room and what you're gonna want to do is go downstairs and go right next to the bathroom door and you will unlock the laundry room where you will get the painting kit the next thing that you're gonna want to go ahead and do is go back to the parents room and right next in the little cabinet you will see the purple key right on the right corner you're going to want to go downstairs and outside the house and go right next to the garage and that will unlock the door to the garage. Inside the garage, you will find the teddy bear that is the last item that's missing. Once you have gathered everything, you will turn it all into Lana and you're going to go to quest number 2. Starting with quest 2, what you're going to want to go ahead and do is Go to the very right and then run straight to the right and you will find room 3 which is Lana's room and the map piece will be behind her bed. Starting at the beginning for the second map piece, what you're going to want to go ahead and do is go straight and take the stairs. So once you go up the stairs, you're going to go ahead and take a left and the first door you see is going to lead you to the bathroom. So you're going to go ahead and go to the bathroom and go to the last stall and get one of the map pieces. After you are done collecting the map piece, you are going to want to go ahead and get out of the bathroom and go straight into the recreational room where you will find another map piece besides some boxes. Starting from the beginning, you're going to want to go ahead and go straight and go back upstairs. And then once you take a turn, you go straight once again and you see a little hallway and you see the storage room in the middle. That will be the other map piece inside. For the last map piece, you're going to want to 
once again go upstairs and here is what I did. I'm gonna be real, I got a little lost, but I went straight, then I took a right, and I went to the wrong room, and then you take another right, and then you're gonna go ahead and go to the nurse's office where you will receive the final piece, guys. And once you get the final piece, you are gonna go ahead and do the chase sequence. Once you are done with the chase sequence, you're gonna walk off like a baddie, and then go to part 3, which is the final quest. In the next clip, I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys how to do the maze. And let me quickly tell you guys, following the fireflies is gonna help you out to get through the maze. So keep on watching guys, it is sped up a little bit, but you will get through this. Now we're in the final step guys, which is defeating the final boss. So what you guys are gonna wanna go ahead and do is firstly kill all of the Lanas. You make sure that you wanna remove them. And after that, you guys are gonna wanna go ahead and step on the rocks because it is going to overflow. So make sure to be careful guys and be quick. Now the next thing, you're gonna be lasered with like huge rocks and what you wanna do is step away from like wherever it's like red so that you make sure that you don't get hit by it or stabbed by the rocks. The next thing that you guys want to do is avoid Lena at all costs and make sure she doesn't get you. She is then going to be doing a huge shockwave so make sure that you are standing on the rocks so that you don't get hit. Now for the last step, what you guys are going to want to do is work as a team to Keep on like hitting Lena and make sure that you defeat her. Once you defeat Lena, you will be going back to Dress to Impress where you will see that you guys have earned 4 new items as a reward for defeating Lena guys. 
here is what all the items look like all together guys and yeah sellers this is what the grand price is and i hope that you guys found this video really helpful i enjoyed making this video so much for you guys and yeah that is gonna be all for today's video i hope you guys enjoyed please don't forget to like comment subscribe and ring that bell if you guys want more tutorials like these and I'll see you guys next time. Before we end the video, please don't forget to subscribe as we are on the road to 50,000 subscribers. We are so close, guys. So don't forget to subscribe. Alright, that is going to be all for today. Thank you guys so much for watching. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye, Stellars.